aspect of that battle that was going on. Of course, uh, what about the ride being put in by Ben Bostrom? His run up across North Finish, it looks like he's got the perfect We're watch Cousin Chris when race. to the stripe, he's got about uh, six or seven miles Scotty. on everybody. Scotty. Plus, he's getting into turn Scotty. so deep. And he has just been riding the wheels off that thing to stay with that lead group. So an Chris's truck there. That Suzuki truck. Chris is in there? She found him? much. Hi, Kylie. What are you doing, girl?
down final time. John Ashby moving up into second place. Big staff holding on to third. If he can hang on here for about a lap, he is going to grab this North American Superbike Series championship for 1995. Less than a lap to go, Pat. Well, the margin, if they stay where they are, by our unofficial calculations here in the tower, will be uh, just about three points separating those two riders because right now, uh, Nobles knew he had to come in here. He was third in the points coming in. He knew he had to win a couple of races. He has done that. But Keith Pinkstaff coming into Daytona was in a position to win the championship. To do it in this final seven lap 25 miler that's just being lined up. In fact, the five minute board already being displayed to the field. Let's take you quickly through the starting grid as they go back to the uh, starting order that uh, they uh, qualified on this morning. Eric Bostrom, uh, number 36. Uh, slated to go on the uh, full position along with uh, probably Matt Waite, uh, I believe, was given that uh, pull after they shuffled around the uh, uh, running order earlier because we had a real photo finish in that uh, qualifier this earlier this Holiday afternoon this or this morning, and Waite was given the uh, full position. And then it is the Rostrum brothers, Ben number 11, Eric 36, and Sean Higby number 21. Three Bartels, Harley Davidson machines up on that front row. Oh, is this Chris's race? Row number two on the inside, nope. number one, Scotty Zambeck, carrying the number one plate. He did win this race a year ago on the Don Tilly's Harley Davidson. Rider number 56 is Greg Hutchison out of LaPorte, Indiana. He'll be on a Harley 883. The British rider number 20, Tim Lee, on one of the Bartels machines of Coventry, England, number 20 starting in that second row, and on the outside, number 60, Trip Nobles, who had a third place finish in that first leg, gets right off of the uh, Kawasaki and jumps on the 883, as uh, he's been one busy man here this afternoon. Rider 65, the veteran Randy Texter out of New Providence, Pennsylvania, will start inside of the third row. The number three machine is Andy Fenwick. Number four, Chuck Blackman. And number 58, the man who you heard of just a couple of minutes Our ago, no, no, no. three-time Daytona 200 winner, a competitor here in our BMW Battle of the Legends the last three years. He'll start outside row three. Who's down there? English Who's down there? One of the Bartels machines, number 22, sits on the inside of row four. The 45 machine of Richie Morris out of uh, Daytona. Up toward the top seven, but he is down and out of it there, waving it off like the turn one. This is the Harley race. Number 11, Bostrom, followed by 95, then 60, then the number one machine of Sandbag back in fourth place, but uh, real close crash there in turn one. Try to get a number on that machine, as you said, Richard. The rider does appear to be okay. I think the number plate is torn off the left side of that machine. But we'll get a report here from the uh, towers to who that is. One of the riders have been running in the top ten. The front-running group of machines through the left-hander here. Turn five of the infield, about to go up to the west banking. There's still six machines tied together. And then a little bit of a gap back to Randy Texter on the number 65 Harley Davidson. Still anybody's race up front. Boy, do they stack it up. Coming off a of NASCAR turn four. And we'll have the four five wide all trying to figure out some kind of drafting uh, strategy as uh, they work now off of NASCAR turn two and down the back straightaway. Dexter still trying to catch that group of six machines. Three wide in the chicane. And I believe it may be Zampak. It is. Scotty Zampak, number one, has gone to the front. Zampak is going to try to break away here, I'm sure. The right of the Because it promises to be just another uh, terrific 
Field. He's going up on the bank. Watch. There he goes. He's going so fast, I lost it.
tested. Yeah. Like here this afternoon, Chris Rogers. Just got cruise control. Uh, Go, Chris! Yeah! Woo! Kelly said, good job, Chris! From Victory Circle. Same, he was saying bye to <laughs> Good job. There's nobody there with you. I don't get my Oh, you forgot it. <laughs> He was so geeked up, he forgot his trophy. <laughs> He's going to get his trophy, he forgot to break it. Hey, good.